I just want to talk for just a few minutes about women and the strength of women. Now, it was interesting as I did a little bit of research, just uh, read a few uh, articles, conference talks, and I typed in strength of women. <coughs> Almost every single one came up with pioneer women. We do live in a difficult time, and there are many challenges ahead of us. But we can stand firm and strong in the faith and make a difference. Everyone makes a difference. So let's be strong and gain a strong testimony. And bring others with us.
These young women, they came up these rocks and they, they did it, but you know, sometimes they couldn't. Sometimes they got, they got stuck in certain places where they just, we didn't have the strength or the willpower to go up and that's where somebody had to step in and help. And whether or not it's our state president, our physical form right now. Whenever we go through things that we can't get over, that's where our Heavenly Father steps in and pulls our cart up one more step and then lets us do the rest. And then once we're done, they didn't just stop, they kept going another quarter mile. And they didn't stop, they just kept going. It's really hard. Um, I hate watching anybody suffer, especially women really wanted to help the entire time. It's really hard sitting back and doing nothing. I feel pretty hopeless. So I'm sure the men that were going on this actual journey and they were all crossing the zone, I'm sure they they felt terrible because they gave all their all they could. Many of them died and they couldn't help anymore. So I know it was hard for me. The woman's pull was really hard to watch. Um, you could see the woman struggling and going up the hill, but it was also amazing to see that they could do it. And after everyone made it up, it was a good realization to know that the woman had the strength. And I was glad that it happened, but it's hard to watch. Like It was really tough. puts into perspective of how hard the pioneers worked and how hard it was for them. It's just amazing that people did that by themselves with people in their wagons and stuff. Just as cool to go through it and see how hard it was. So to get through the women's pool, my family, we all decided to pray for each other. So instead of thinking of ourselves and thinking, I'm so weak, I'm not sure if I can make it up this hill, we were praying for each other saying, please God give us strength so we can get up this hill together. And we all worked together and we did it. So our family was a lot fewer in numbers, um, we only had four and it was really, really hard uh, to make it up those big <laughs> rocks but we did it by counting and working together um, and we'd all just shove and put our whole might into it. Um, we were really relying on the Lord through it all um, and we made it and it's crazy that the pioneers went through so much more through wind and uh, rain, snow, and they had fewer people and they were already weak from hunger. It's just crazy um, and it shows us we can really, we can really do hard things. Uh, through the women's poll we all had to work together and my ma said that instead of thinking about your own strength, thinking about how much your arms are going to hurt or instead of thinking about, oh, I got to make it to the top, she said for us to pray for one another. So I would be praying for my sister, which is the one next to me, and just saying, please help her get up the hill, just her get up the hill, not me, not focusing on me, but my family, just one person. And I think with even just one less person or with one less prayer, I think we wouldn't have been able to make it and I'm grateful for that unity we have.